Imagine a towering oak tree. Its strength isn't just in its trunk or leaves. It's in the soil beneath, packed with minerals, microbes, and organic matter. Without the right mix, even the mightiest tree weakens. Our emotional health works the same way. The unseen nutrients, supportive relationships, meaningful routines, and self-reflection form the foundation that keeps us resilient. When these are missing, we might look fine on the outside, but inside, we're struggling to grow. Soil isn't just dirt, it's a living ecosystem. The best soil has a balance of sand, silt, clay, and organic matter, each playing a unique role. Similarly, emotional health isn't about one thing. It's a blend, a bit of challenge, a dash of comfort, and plenty of connection. If one element dominates or is missing, the whole system suffers. Just as trees need diverse nutrients, we need a mix of experiences and support to truly thrive. When soil is depleted, stripped of nutrients or compacted, trees become vulnerable to disease and drought. The same goes for us. Chronic stress, isolation, or neglect can drain our emotional reserves, leaving us less able to cope with life's challenges. But just as gardeners amend soil with compost and care, we can replenish our emotional nutrients through rest, connection, and new experiences. Recovery isn't instant, but small changes can restore vitality over time. Some trees adapt to poor soil by growing deeper roots or forming symbiotic relationships with fungi. Humans, too, can adapt to tough circumstances by seeking out new sources of support or learning new coping skills. It's not about having perfect conditions. It's about making the most of what's available and finding creative ways to nourish ourselves. Even in rocky ground, resilience can take root if we're willing to reach out and connect. Next time you see a thriving tree, remember, its vitality starts underground in the invisible world of roots and soil. Our emotional health is just as dependent on what's beneath the surface. By tending to our foundational nutrients, relationships, routines, and self-care, we can weather life's storms and keep growing strong. The lesson from the forest? Don't just look at the leaves. Nourish your roots and the rest will follow.